and it's 2.32 p.m. So can we um, bring this meeting to order? Please do. All right. Okay. And I'll leave it to the next. J Jamie, you're muted. Okay. Good. Okay. So our chair, that's you, D. You get to, uh, yeah. So um, the first order of business is to approve the, the minutes. Um, and we're going to look at, that's why I was trying to look at the recording, um, September 27th. And can I interject for a second? Yes. Um, on, on the agenda, I put public comment oh, first. I'm so sorry. Yes, that's okay. Let me look at it because yep. I it's... am juggling here. Okay. And just three things. It was public comment, approval of minutes, and then any other topics. So just those three things. Okay. Because I do see we do have an attendee. Sharon Sherry's in attendance. So. So do I, they're, you're going to let them speak. I'm, I'm assuming I'm looking for my agenda. Yeah, I can do that um, if, if they want to speak. Let's try to fix something here. Couldn't hear very well. Yeah, D literally, it's just number one, public comment, number two, approval of the four sets of minutes. And then the last is um, any other topics that, you know, did not come up within 24 or 48 hours. That email was different from the panelist email, was it? I'm sorry, I'm just looking No, I don't think I sent that email. It's just a posted meeting. Oh, it's the post, okay, all right. Yeah, the meeting agenda that got posted, yep. Um, the only thing that I, that I, um, change in this is like an election of the chair and this is um Jacqueline Wagner and I don't remember I remember talking about adding the vice chair but I'm not sure if that's what what it was I, I can't put my name there for that because I remember bringing it up but I, I also okay. thought maybe, well I we're also, not there excuse Hold me excuse well no me. I thought Sherry Sherry was speaking or was going to speak no, we're pub, um, the first item on our agenda is public comment. So we should open right. the floor to anybody that wants to speak. I was just mentioning who's in the attendance. Oh, I thought you said she had her hand up to uh, no, speak. Okay. No, I, no, but we do have public comment first. So we should op open the floor in case she wants to speak. Okay. Okay. It's not that I'm trying to cut you off, Jacqueline. It's just that yeah. since there was mm -hmm. someone. Well, when she opened it up, I assumed I could speak. <laughs> So does the public want to speak or have, or have I'm comments? Looking. I don't see, I don't see her hand raised. Okay. So, All right. okay. So nope. sorry, Jacqueline. Mm -hmm. Like I said, on the election of the chair, it's Jacqueline Wagner. I'm, I remember bringing that up, but I'm not sure if it was either me or Jamie, but you can change oh, that. Today. So That's September twenty seventh. Okay, hold yeah. on one second because mm -hmm. I have. Let mm -hmm. me open that document and share it. Okay. Because I think yeah. I did make changes. Um, okay. Yeah. You may yeah. Have. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So let me just get that and share the screen. So that's why I was trying to to listen to the recording because Jacqueline, I believe you brought it up, and then Jamie agreed. You know, as far that's as what I'm saying. I don't. I don't really remember, but I did make a. And then I did, we voted I, I on it. A part of it, so I'm okay with that. Putting my name on it. Yeah, just right. so it's reflected. It should be reflected accurately. But yeah, that's why when I went looking for the the right. thing, it was nowhere to be found. Um. All right. So do you see the September 27th minutes? Oh yeah. You yeah. see them? Okay. So let me yeah. just let me see. Um. Hold on one second. One page. And make it bigger. Whoops, too big. All 
All right. So where do we, where are we to? Okay. So here on four, if you go down to where four, four is. Yeah. Jamie Wagner. Uh -huh. Well, Jamie and Jackie Gardner. Okay. And then. Oh, there you are. Okay. Right there. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. yeah. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Yep. There we go. Okay. 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 Let me save that. Okay. Were there any other things in here? I'll start. Um, yes. Go back up. The same in four. Same for off back to four. Okay. Yeah. So we're underneath the paragraph there where um, there's motion and then Jamie Wagner, Wagner felt. Then there's Demetria Shabazz felt. So there's one, two, three, four. Fourth. Okay. I got yeah. my cursor on it. Mm -hmm. Demetria Shabazz felt the town clerk should be separate from the board of registrars and not service chair. Uh, Susan Audette concurred. So and that's why I was looking up the, the <laughs> recording because it was more of a conversation, Sue, where you offered that uh, you had recently been to the Board of Registrars, uh, was it the state meeting? And, Mass Town Clerk Association, yeah. Yeah, um, the, and that uh, there was a discussion about uh, who should serve as chair within the board of registrars and and then you also um uh offered that you went through the notes from the previous town clerks mm -hmm. and that um the town clerk usually did not serve as chair so it just seems <laughs> you know that dimitri jabaz is suggesting this and you're concurring but it doesn't offer the evidence as to why i got it yeah So I just wanted the it to reflect that as the evidence as to why. Which might okay, be I'm helpful. gonna I'll word it nicely and, and put that yeah. in there. There we go. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, yeah. right. I'll so, mention those two things. Okay. So that we don't, you know, have to go through whoever serves in this role. Basically, again. MTCA and notes. Okay. Got it. Okay. And then my reading of the rest of them um, was fine. Of the rest of that one. Jamie, you have anything to offer in terms of the minutes? No, but I just, I had really just that one, the Jacqueline Wagner thing stuck out to me also, but that's already been fixed, but I didn't have anything else that seemed like it warranted changing or adding to. Okay. Well, um, Sue, that was it. Okay. Well, someone so needs to make a motion. All right, I move to, to I move to approve the minutes um, as amended for the Monday, September twenty seventh meeting. Okay, Jackie, you want to second it? Um, you can second it. Oh, okay. I'm just offering. Um, yeah. So I second. Um, everyone. Uh, let's see. So I second it, and we all are in favor. Yes. Aye. Aye. Okay. Um, I think that's it. It's approved. We have to do a roll call vote, but um, oh well, D, because it's Zoom. Yeah. Yes. Z D <laughs> uh, says yay. Jamie. Yay. Okay, Jackie. Yay. Yeah. So. And me too. Yay. Okay. All right. All right. So that's that set. All right. Let me get the next one up on the screen and save it and close it. Okay, can, can we all see this one? Yes. Okay, good. So my, my only question on this one was, I mean, I wasn't at this meeting, so I really can't speak to anything in it, but are we, it has with everybody's name and addresses, is that like, just standard okay to have in the, just a general public minutes or I mean it's public knowledge anyways or I mean it just um, seems a lot of information there I mean not so none of us get it but so let's see the ballots belonging to um it, it is public information because that is what's on the voter list and people can look at the voter list it's nothing that's um okay yeah yeah, because we check those people off the voter list for their appropriate precincts based on their addresses. 
All right. And it was read out loud when we were doing it, so. But other for me, otherwise, I don't have, I mean, I didn't see anything and I wasn't there, so I really can't yeah. say anything about it. Yeah. Also, I will add, this one I noticed doesn't have the footer for the Board of Registrars approved on the state, and I'll just add, I'll add the footer. Mm. Are there any corrections to be made for November 8th? Oh, I can make a motion to approve the minutes with Sue's addition of that footer to the November 8th, 2021 minutes. Okay, I didn't know if Jackie was still looking. Uh, I was, um, yeah, 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 I'm, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Okay. Then Jamie, you want to make that motion? Sure. I move to accept the minutes from November 8th, 2021 with Sue's addition of the footer, um, for the approval line. Um, yeah. Okay. I'll, I'll second that one. All right. It's been seconded. All in favor? Aye. Aye. So Jackie's I, Jamie? I. I, and D is I. And Sue? I. Are you? Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's get the next one up. That would be 1115. All right. The only thing I really noted on this one was D did show up um, partway through. So I don't know if she should be into um, the members present or did she show up after we had handled the business? So it was still considering her absence. Good question. Yeah, so um, the meeting hadn't been adjourned as yet. No. I don't no. mind it reflecting that I was um, late and missed the vote, but um, the meeting had not adjourned. Okay. Yeah, that's a good, because you weren't absent. Okay, that's a good point. I think I started, you know. No worries. Yeah, yep, let's fix that. And. Okay. All right, and there we go. Yeah, and it reflects that I arrived, um, okay, at 10.25. Okay, any other corrections or additions? I don't have any on my end. Jackie? I don't have any either. All right. All right. Um, I hold on oh, one sec. Oh, Sorry. Sorry. Um, this one has to have a footer as well. <laughs> Sorry. This is just, so, you know, administrative stuff. Yeah. So is the template changed or something, or it was just trying to keep up? Don't always use a template. Oh, okay. Yeah. It depends on this is a short, sweet little thing, so I just typed it. Oh, okay. Sometimes it's harder to work with something that pre exists and make it work the formatting. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, yeah. I do. Yeah. Yes, I, yeah. I make a motion to accept the minutes um, as amended from the November 15th, 2021 meeting. Okay, I second it. Okay, everyone's in favor? Yes. I'm aye. in favor. Okay, Jackie's I, Jamie's I, I am I. And Jamie. I am I. Okay. All right. Okay. Let me save this one. And the last one. I just want to say this is the last set of minutes. Um, however, we'll have today's set of minutes, which I can read to you all, and we can approve them. And that way we've gotten, we're completely up to date. Okay. Yeah. All right. This one's long. Yeah. And hold on one second. 
I have to put a footer on that one too. Let me know if I should scroll down. Oh. Yes, I'm ready. Okay. Scroll a little bit, yes? Yes. Okay, start top page two. Time to scroll again? Sure. Yes. OK. OK. Oh, I, okay. I, I do have one question about the Evan Ross. You have 473, and then in the thing that was written, it's 474. So up here, total tally. So um, the recount. Oh, now yeah, now it's 474. Okay, gotcha. Right. I, I got I've it. got, yeah, recount okay. results and then election night results. Yeah. Okay, gotcha. Okay. okay. Oh, Jackie, I see. I misspelled your name over here. I just noticed it. J A C. Okay. Okay. Oh, my goodness. I'm not going to take it personally. I know. Good. <laughs> I, I type fast. Sometimes I, I miss things or I add extra things. I just, yeah. <laughs> When I was doing medical transcription, I had so many shortcut keys. I would type like three letters and it would spell out the whole yeah. 20 <laughs> five lettered word. Um, <laughs> I got to get more of those going. <laughs> so let's know when you finish reading. I'm all set, Jamie, on my end. I'm all, I'm all set too. But I do have one question though, in regards to um, where these numbers for the seals they were like verified there and were they verified again? I just want to make sure that the numbers are 
uh, correct. That's all I guess I'm asking. Um, I read them out loud when yeah, we okay. put them on and wrote them down. So okay, okay. Yeah. I just want to know if it was that anything. was it. Yeah. And yeah. yeah. Okay. okay. All right. At, at well, this well. point, we've passed the thirty day retention anyway, and that's all been. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> you know. Yeah, but, so. Yeah. Okay. Water under the bridge. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. All right. So, anyone wants to make a motion for approval? Well, I make a motion to approve the November twenty third. Uh, 2021 uh, meeting minutes. I second that. All, right, all in favor? Aye. aye. Okay, Jackie, aye. aye. Jamie? Aye. And D is aye. Sue? Aye. Okay. okay. All right. Um, so the current, this meeting's minutes, Board of Registrars, December 14th, 2021. What I have is that the meeting is called to order at 2.32 p.m. We started recording at that time. We opened the floor for public comment, which there was none. And then we started on the approval of four sets of minutes, and not including this one. Um, the minutes of 927, Jackie Wagner made a motion to approve as amended. D. Shabazz seconded. Vote was um, unanimous by roll call. And then the minutes of November 8th, uh, we voted, let's see, Jackie Wagner moved to approve as amended by adding, the amendment would be adding a footer. Um, um, sorry, I mean, Jamie, Jamie, Jamie. did I say Jackie? Oh my said God. Jackie twice, but I just want to make sure. I did, sorry, sorry. No, no. You know, I've got, I'm using JW, JG, and, and DS. <laughs> but I'll write it all out. I was getting ready to say, you know, they're oh a lovely God. family, but. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Wait, so the first one was uh, Jamie ma made the move uh, motion to approve. The second one, Jamie made the motion to approve <laughs> and Jackie seconded. And vote was um, unanimous by roll call. November 15th minutes, we voted, um, we, Jamie made a motion to approve as amended by adding the footer. D seconded that one, voted all in favor. It was unanimous by roll call. And then November 23rd, um, Jackie <laughs> made a motion to approve <laughs> and to approve um, as amended. And Jamie seconded it and we voted all in favor, favor unanimously. So that's what I have for minutes um, with the exception of, of course, when the, this meeting will close. So adjourn. I move um, to approve the minutes from today's meeting as Sue just read to us. A second. A second. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Doesn't matter. All yeah. right, all in favor? Mm -hmm. Aye. Okay, Jackie. Jamie, say aye. Dee says aye. aye. Yep. Sue? Aye. All right. Now we can all right. Hold on. And unanimous. Okay. All right. And then the last thing on our agenda is um, Sorry, you should be doing this, D, not me. Sorry. Well, um, since I can't find the <laughs> agenda on the town hall website, uh, you know, I don't know why. You have to go through calendar. It's not yeah, very you... logical. Okay. So I didn't go through calendar. I looked up Board of Registrar, so it just doesn't seem Oh, okay. Logical. Okay. Yeah. So anyway. Little, um, yeah. Is it public uh, open again to public comment or? No, actually it was um, any other topics oh, okay. that we may want to bring up. Well, I don't I have guess, anything. Yeah, when we're meeting again. Um, once oh, uh, the you're muted, Jamie. Here. Sorry, I was talking to my daughter. Okay. <laughs> So for the following year, um, when we will meet again, one of the things I would, like I said, I would like to do is um, make the board of registrars like an FAQ. Um, so folks kind of understand what happens during an election and um, particularly post-election. So you know, leading up to election, post-election, and they have a clear sense of procedure. 
So that's something that I don't think a, a meeting would have to be called maybe to approve it for every, you know, for the board of registrars to represent us as a whole. But um, perhaps that just could be something where I sit with Sue and we create an FAQ or procedure sheet and then have a meeting to approve that um, as a group. So that's my yeah. suggestion. Yeah, we had talked about that at the meeting where we were counting the ballot. So yeah, January is a nice, quiet month. We can we can just email each other and, you know, unless everybody wants to weigh in on it, but um, we'll go well, from I'm there. Sure a descending a vote on, on that particular thing, because I think that, it, it, it again, it could cause like a lot of confusion. And also a lot of times too, do you want like the, the, um, the council to like look over what we have or what's the process gonna be? Because it seems like we're sort of like stepping into the territory of the election department um, uh, jurisdiction. So personally, I wouldn't be in favor of it. But I'd have to see what what you're talking about too, because a lot of times this, this stuff has already been like Q and A'd. They got a lot of stuff on the election sites, and maybe even meeting somebody with the election department and asking what their opinions are and that kind of thing before just barging ahead and getting something that could blow up in our faces. So uh, I think Sue had uh, mentioned that basically these are all part of not only election law, but the, the bylaws, and we're simply putting it into an FAQ uh, sheet to, to put on the website. And this so, is what I'm saying. Somebody else should be looking at it, and there may already be something of already of out and available that can um, be already put, put there. And that's what I'm talking about, because I don't want any conflicts between what's already out there and what we're putting out there. Well, no, I, I wouldn't uh, <laughs> want that either. Okay. So I, what I'm saying is that uh, we create something comprehensive and streamlined that people could reference um, quickly and easily. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, that's something that would have to be, of course, uh, looked at by uh, town officials and uh not to mention Sue, of course, we'd make this together. But if necessary, uh, you know, election officials as well. And then we would, again, I'm, I'm suggesting as a, our own procedure is that we would look at it together, call a meeting to look at it together and have a consensus mm -hmm. on how it's to represent well, the board yeah. of registrars. Mm -hmm. Well, I have a dissenting vote on that. And also when you're looking at the types of things of what the, what the purpose of the uh, Board of Registrars and things like that, doesn't really address those kinds of things either. Like we're responsible for putting out, you know, um, stuff. Because again, to me, you, you, you're infringing on the election department's toes on this one. So it's really to represent what the Board of Registrars does. Um, okay, well, if you all want to do it, fine, but I'm not, I'm not in favor of it. Well, why don't, we, why don't we sit down and meet and come up with something and see what we're thinking of and see if it's, it's something that's actually helpful to the public. It sounds like the whole uh, purpose of doing something like this is to bring awareness to um, post-election tasks that our office does. So maybe we could do that, put something together and then come together as a board and, and either say, yeah, this is a good thing or I don't see how this is helpful you know, before we do anything further with it. You know, I'm all for the education as well. Um, and, it, and this is- I'm, It's not oh, no, I'm, anti education. I, I, I felt that someone said that last time and that's not what I was talking about as, as far as like, to me, as far as like the, the confusion, conflict, and no one mentioned bringing it before the town council, no one mentioned about going into the, the, the Department of Elections. It sounded like it was something that, oh, this sounds like it's a good idea, let's do it. But there was no background on how it was gonna be done, what the process is, and whether or not it's gonna be in conflict with any of the current laws that are there. Yeah, no, this is, this is obviously uh, new, so, um, 
we okay, again i'm out i'm out okay. if you want to do it right. you know, okay feel so, free. Yeah. <laughs> so one of the real quick one of the the things that um i've been looking at and um it's since the redistricting group met and uh sue was part of that group i was part of that group um Peggy Shannon, who was part of that group, had contacted Mindy Dom, um, and we've all been in conversation about how to educate, particularly not only the public, so that they have um, a sense of trust for some, because some don't, you know, and I think that's, you know, I think Sue had even stated it's part of a national issue, but it's also part of a local issue. And so having clarity uh, in terms of process would help with that. Uh, and Mindy Dom uh, and I and some others are going to begin figuring out uh, groups to work with on college campuses, particularly UMass, um, and how to educate young people about the election process. So I see this in, in personally as an extension of some of the community work I've committed to. So, um, you yeah. know, again, whether it's a good idea or not, I, I think having um, transparency, educating, you know, folks okay. on the process is mm -hmm. a positive thing, no matter what. And again, I'm not disputing the issue of transparency or education. I just think that it's just a slippery slope that we're going up right now because no one will ever really trust the government, that's for sure. So no matter Wait. what you do. Well, you know, what's interesting is before every election, I do put out a fact I did before this election, um, mm -hmm. but just there are so many things to cover. You know, mm -hmm. one fact is not a cover all. And the one I did was, um, on how to get absentee ballots and how to vote early and all of that portion and that went on the town website and you know mm -hmm. this is on the state there are th the information's out there in multi places and i know what you're saying you don't want to be putting it out on your own place and it's in you know it's it's, it, it's it's you know quoting something wrong on the state level on the local level so i know that's mm -hmm. we got to be careful with that but mm -hmm. also um and like you said too if you can point to people to the state level and they can find it easy enough. That's great too. But I think people just tend to go on the town website and want to look for it there and not have to dig further. Mm -hmm. So um, one of the things though, if you do go on to the election department website, it's fantastic. If you can't- On the States, I know. Everything. Yeah, it's, it's, you know, everything that's there. So I think me, people don't know like where to go. Do, you know? I think people that's, don't know where to even start though. But this is what, what I was getting ready to say, too. You can make like some cross links or references to where to look for these ideas that I won't object to. But some of this other stuff is like this manufacturing. Um, well, that's that's already done. That's done. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah it's already yeah. on our town website. Yeah. Click this link to get the information on this. Click this link mm -hmm. to get the that's done. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I think identifying what we're trying to come up with and if it's already done in piecemeal, maybe we can pull something together in one place mm -hmm. to make mm -hmm. it more concise. Um, mm -hmm. Yes, yeah. something concise, comprehensive, where people could read it um, and certainly look for further information. Um, I think if we, uh, you know, not to, to say, I'm just saying anecdotally, um, survey folks or talk to folks in the town, um, they're going to go on the town website and look for this information and are frustrated like i was looking for the the recorded video um and then found some breaks in the links you know which i then contacted angela mills you know at town hall to let her know about it since the break in those links had to do with amherst media which is a group i'm affiliated with so folks often don't have the time <laughs> or um, are, are just going to complain because they, they, they're not finding what they need easily. And I just think on our end, since we are part of this group, if we could help add to the, the ease of you know, information finding, particularly to our, our committee and our group, um, that that would be useful. So. Um, if you're willing to meet with me, Sue, and we uh, come up with, you know, something streamlined, even when it refers to the state 
uh, laws, um, I'd be willing to uh, do that. And then, like I said, we could present um, something to our group so that it would represent those who want to participate in this process. Yeah, I'll send you an email in January after the um, holidays are over and we can set something up. Sounds good. Yeah. Okay, any other items to discuss? I don't have anything. Okay, well, happy Kwanzaa, happy holidays, <laughs> and um, see you all uh, next year. I'll look for your email, Sue, and um, I guess we just need to have uh, someone uh, make a motion to end the meeting. <laughs> I move to adjourn today's meeting. Okay. Jackie, did you want a second? I thought you were for you were making the motion and Jamie was seconding it. Oh, well no. I that's that's how I was interpreted Okay. I well, can were you making the, the suggestion that <laughs> you were you making a suggestion to make the motion? <laughs> okay. So I'll <laughs> I got confused. <laughs> okay. So I second the motion, uh, or you're seconding it, Jamie, whichever one you want to put, Sue. All in okay. favor. <laughs> We're ending. Everyone it's... was in favor of leaving. Okay. Yes, I know. I I, I am in favor, Sue. So okay. Wanda. So if it's roll call, I as well. Jamie? Aye. Jackie? Aye. All righty. All right. Happy holidays, everybody. Happy Bye. holidays, everybody. See you Bye. on the flip side. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Bye.